Hi, this is a demonstration of a prototype wireless backhaul solution designed to operate in the UHF frequency band currently being used for TV. The two key features of this system are, firstly, it maintains the wireless link by detecting and avoiding interference, and secondly, does not interfere with existing TV services operating in the band. Let's show you how this works. The laptop on the right is acting as the base station, and the laptop on the left is the access point. Normally the distance between these two points in a wireless backhaul link would be between 20 and 160 kilometers. The box on the top is a vector signal generator, which is transmitting a real digital TV signal captured over the air from a transmitter on Tree Rock Mountain in Dublin, Ireland. The box in the bottom is a spectrum analyzer to allow us to monitor spectrum usage in the frequency band. Here is our digital TV transmission, and we're going to move this transmission around the band to try and disrupt our backhaul link, and to demonstrate how digital TV signals are detected and avoided using our system. This is our base station with an RF front end used for sensing on the right hand side. We're using a universal soft radio peripheral from Edis Research for this prototype. Four channels are displayed on the screen. Red indicates an occupied channel, one that we should not use. Green indicates an available channel that we can use. And the channel we're currently using for our backhaul link is indicated using flashing orange. This is the access point on the other end of the backhaul link, showing the video stream and channel usage. The backhaul link is using channel 2 in this case. Now we change the channel that the digital TV signal is using to interfere with channel 2. The base station detects the TV transmission. The backhaul link now changes from channel 2 to an available channel, channel 4. The access point is now using channel 4 also, and we can see the video transmission operating as normal. Let's change the TV channel again. The backhaul link is using channel 1 to begin with in this example. Panning to the base station, you can see that the digital TV signal is detected and the base station changes the backhaul link from channel 1 to channel 4. And finally, taking a look at the access point at the other end of the backhaul link, we can see the channel is now also 4 and the video link is still operating.